If you're an active user of the Meta Quest, then you are probably aware that Meta doesn't roll out new updates for the Quest to every user all at once. This can be quite frustrating as with each new update, the Quest seems to be getting a whole host of amazing new features. That is why I created today's video to show you how to update your Quest to the latest version without having to wait. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. To do this, you're going to need a computer or a laptop, you're going to need your headset of choice, whether that be the 2, 3, or Pro. And then you're going to want a USB-C type cable that you can use to connect your headset to your laptop or desktop. Now that you've got all that, begin by putting on your headset and entering into your settings. Click on System, then select Software Update to check if you have an update available. If you do, go ahead and select Update Now. Give it a few minutes in order to install the update. Once that is completed, go ahead and restart your headset and you should be on the latest version. If that is not the case, go ahead and select the backup menu. And then you should see a cloud backup switch. Toggle on cloud backup. This is in case of emergencies. That way all of your data gets stored in the cloud and you don't lose anything if the update goes wrong. Once you have toggled on cloud backup, then go ahead and power off your device by holding down the power button for three seconds. After your headset is fully powered down, wait a few seconds, then hold down the power button and the volume button simultaneously in order to power onto the boot screen. Once powered on, release both of the buttons immediately. Using the volume buttons, navigate to the side load update option. Select it by clicking the power button once. You'll know you have done everything right when the indicator LED on the side of the headset turns purple. Once you have done that, take off your headset and plug it into your computer slash laptop. Then on your computer, open a web browser and navigate to the Meta Software Update page. If you're having issues finding it, the page will be linked down in the description. On this page, go ahead and select your headset. You can ignore what's on screen as you have already completed those steps. Click continue. Then again, you'll see another screen with a list of steps which you have already completed. If you are having issues with the boot screen, refer to this page for additional help. Otherwise, go ahead and click connect device. Select your headset from the pop-up in the browser, then select connect. If you get this error that you're seeing on screen now, odds are that you have something such as SideQuest or another software that connects to your headset running on your computer, which is interfering with the process. To solve this, close all external applications and restart the process. If you get this error that you see on screen, then your headset likely timed out and you need to put it back into the side load update mode from the boot screen. If all goes swimmingly, you should have been met with this page that you see on screen now. Go ahead and select start download. Give it a few minutes for that to finish and make sure to continue to keep your headset plugged in. After it is done downloading the update, go ahead and click install software. This will likely take a little longer than the download, and once again, keep your headset connected to your computer. Once you get the text saying that the update was successful, then you are all good to go. One disclaimer I would like to give is that this is a tool provided by Meta primarily for troubleshooting purposes, and therefore is meant to be used when your headset is running into issues that an update can solve. That being said, this tool is not meant to be used for force updating, and thus comes with some risks, hence the backup. With that out of the way, if this video helped you out, a like would be greatly appreciated and consider subscribing if you want to continue to learn more about your MetaQuest. That's it for me. Enjoy. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Bye.